This video will demonstrate the usage of the ACOS function in Excel. R cosine is the inverse of the cosine function and thus is one of the inverse trigonometric functions. In a right angle triangle, the cosine of an angle is the ratio of its adjacent side to the hypotenuse. ACOS function returns the R cosine or inverse cosine of a number. The R cosine is the angle whose cosine is a number. The returned angle is given in radians in the range of 0 to pi. Now let's check the syntax. The ACOS function syntax has the following argument and that's number. This number is the cosine of an angle you want and must be from minus 1 to 1. Let's run it with an example. I set up here three results we want to get. First one in radians, the second two in degrees. I have also used formula text function to show you what I typed. Since I told you that this number has to be between minus 1 and 1, this is why I entered if error in addition, because when we are showing nothing, you will get an error message. So let's start. ACOS and then select the number. And in this case, we are going to get the result in radians. Now, the second one I want to show you is how to get it in degrees. times 180 over pi. And the last one is to use degrees function. And now we need to get an angle. And press enter. So there you have it. Three ways to get ACOS function running. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, hit the like button and consider subscribing to channel to support its growth. Thank you and see you in the next one.